Hello guys, I'm going to show you how to create this configurator for this tutorial. I'm going to create three layers and show you how to set a product like this using WP Configurator plugin. Let's go into the video. Before you start, make sure you have prepared all the images. I created the images already. I'm going to show you the example. I have four groups. First, base color. I have this base color. You see, white, gray, and black. This is the shoe base color. And I have the second color. See, blue, green, and orange. Another color, black. Also, two more layers. This one is for interior. Another one is straps. You see, if you see, you can see the different colors. Straps are in different colors. These are images we have created for the configurator. You can use any images. It doesn't have to be a color. You can use any other images. For example, different textures or something like that. After you prepared these images, you have to prepare the icons for this black, gray, blue. For these icons, I have prepared some icons as well. You can see I have created some icons to upload there. Now, go to plugins. Make sure you activated both WooCommerce and Product WooCommerce Configurator. Make sure you have activated WooCommerce first, then activate Product WooCommerce Configurator to avoid any errors. Then go to products. Add new product. Now create a product. I'm going to name it sneaker because I already have a sneaker product. So I'm going to create two. Then go to configurator, new configurator. Open a new tab because we have to come back to this product again. I have to create a configurator. Now name the configurator. I'm going to name it Sneakers Config. You can name anything you want. Now scroll down and choose Sneakers 2. We have just created this product. And say set the base price. You can set anything you want. I'm going to set $300. Then go to Now scroll down, you will see this, you will see this viewing, view area and the layers area on the side and bunch of settings on the right side. I'm going to show you how to create layers first. Click the add button below. What this, this creates a group. We have four groups here, so I'm going to create four groups. And we, I'm going to name it. First one is base color. Hit the save button. Now scroll down again. And hit this plus button. What this do? It's create the sub layer. I mean child, child layer for this group. I have three base color. You see, I have three base color images. So I'm going to th create three layers. Now I'm going to add icon and images. I already uploaded the icon images. You can see here. Here it is. I'm going to set first one is black. I'm going to choose the product image same black color to match its to match the icon i'm going to choose white for second one third one is gray click the group layer and check is required option this option help you to set any of these layers must choose in the configurator product page before add to cart. 
or the check is required. You must choose which option, which layer you want to be active on the load. For example, check this product. When I refresh the page, white is the active layer on this product. I am going to choose black to be active on this active on load in this product. I am going to set the black and set the price for few layers and hit the save button. I am going to the product page, refresh the page and scroll down and choose the configurator here. Sneakers config is the product we have chosen and I am going to choose this. And if you see, we set base price 300. We have to set the same price here. Let's update and review the product. As you choose the configurator here, you will see the configurator on the single product page instead of default configurator. I am going to config remaining layers. For this layer, I am not going to choose is record and active on load. We will see what is the difference between the active on load and is record. Configurator comes with three styles. This is style 1. If you want to see the same style as preview, you have to choose accordion style in the drop down menu. Since we haven't chosen active on load option, on page loads, none of these layers is active. Also we haven't choose is record option. Because of that, user can deselect these layers and add to cart, add to cart this product. Hope you like this short tutorial. We will create in-depth tutorial in the future. Please look further. See you.